What's up YouTube? Coming to you guys back with another video. Uh, I know it's been a while, but I'm, I'm happy to be coming back with another video. It's been pretty busy, um, especially here in Las Vegas. We had SEMA uh, two weeks ago. Uh, I got to meet some some great people, uh, Hunter Bro Jason, uh, John at LH, L LHT and his crew, and also uh, some of the guys at uh, United Speed Racing. Um, I had a great conversations with them, and uh, it was just great hanging out. Uh, at the H day meet, there was a piece of uh, SEMA. So, enough with that. Um, let's get started with the unboxing. Uh, we have the hybrid racing uh, short shifter assembly uh, for the FK8. So, uh, let's go ahead and unbox that. All right, guys, so we had kind of a box in a box. Um, we got their uh, product information guide or product information brochure. And uh, they also threw in a t shirt. So, uh, thank you for that. It's pretty cool. And uh, this is the short shifter assembly itself. Um, and I did get the launch edition and the special red color. So uh, let's go ahead and unbox this again and we'll, uh, we'll get the shifter out. Alright guys, so we have everything out the box and just giving you a look at the shifter assembly itself. Uh, once again, this is the uh, Hybrid Racing. This is the launch edition in a special red color. Uh, normally they come in like a gold color, which is pretty cool as well, but um, since this was a um, something different, I just wanted to, you know, uh, try out the different color. Um, I haven't decided on how I'm going to... Uh, assemble the shifter if I'm going to leave it exposed or or, or cover it using the OEM um, shift boot collar cover and shift knob um, I think initially I am going to install it and just leave it with the uh, you know with the OEM look uh, using the the uh, Overland Designs uh, suede shift boot co cover that I have and along with the uh, with the stock shift knob I'm gonna use that for now uh, maybe changing it down the line but uh, for initial install and impressions i'll be using that so yeah just give you guys a quick look at the entire assembly itself um, here is the piece of a mount up there as well to connect your ship knob um, there is an additional spring and some uh some bolts like i said the uh, product information guide the shirt online guide or, or install guides to follow um, and a sticker as well so I appreciate that and <clears throat> I'm gonna look to get this installed in the next week uh, hopefully uh, I know what holidays and everything coming up um, I'm probably gonna be a little bit busy but uh, if I find some time I'll definitely try to uh, try to get this installed um, as soon as possible and uh, bring that video to you guys as well so yeah super excited about this um, if you're asking why am I uh, switching to this I am a big fan of the way that the stock uh, Civic Type R shifts um, and it's shift or, or shifting assembly is just fine in my opinion. I um, just want to see if this is a you know in any way can make it a little bit better um, and if so um, I'll give it a try and if for some reason I don't like it then I'll take it off but uh, pretty confident um, seeing this in, in other, in other uh, cars you know other B series other K series I'm uh, pretty confident in this shifter that it's uh, that it's fairly uh, better than the stock so I'm uh, very excited to get this done um, and uh, super excited to get it installed. Uh, so stay tuned for that. Um, I appreciate everyone. Um, if you support the channel, I definitely appreciate it. If you guys like this video, uh, definitely hit that like button. And if you are not subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button as well, as I have some uh, some future videos coming out as well. Um, did recently get the cartoon with Honda. So uh, I'm looking to give you guys my impressions. It's been tuned for about a month and a, a little bit over a month now. So I think that's been a good fair uh, fair amount of time uh, to give my impressions on the uh, off the shelf tune that I'm running right now on Honda. And also I have the PRL inlet charge 
inlet pipe uh, coming in. I uh, still have the charge pipes as well that I have yet to install. So uh, looking to do all of that at once. And along with the shore shifter, now the car has been tuned. Even though it's an off the shelf map, it does feel good. So uh, yeah, the car is definitely coming along. Uh, so stay tuned. And that's gonna be a wrap for this video, guys. Um, once again, I appreciate the support and I'm out.